So Mary Lou, for me, is the conscience and the soul of Dredef. Um, she's been the moral compass that has guided the staff since Dredef began close to 28 years ago. No matter what part of Dredef's policy you examine, you'll find Mary Lou's counsel behind um, the issues. And those, that counsel took those, that policy one step closer to the edge, and most of the time over the edge. A little known fact about a secret about the ADA that I'll share with you tonight. Late one night, 26 years ago, when I represented Dredef in DC, I excitingly called Mary Lou to tell her that we had just finished the negotiation with Senator Kennedy and Senator Harkin, and they had signed off on the policy that all new construction was to be, from this date on, was going to be accessible. So the dream of integration into society for people with disabilities was in fact going to be rea a reality. I was so proud of myself. I expected the same from Mary Lou. Instead, I got silence. After a very, very, very long pause, she said, well, that's great for the future, but it won't have any impact on my life or the rest of the community now. I still won't be able to pee. Mary Lou was right. Needless to say, the next morning I went to Senator Kennedy and Senator Harkin and explained that there needed to be a change in the draft to cover existing buildings and programs. I could still remember the look on their faces. Well, as you all can probably guess, that's how readily achievable was added to the ADA and why the community didn't have to wait for new construction for access to civil rights. As a lead trainer during the 504 days, she trained hundreds of adults with disabilities and parents of children with disabilities to become civil rights advocates. She's counseled law students, civil rights lawyers, medical professions, and operates, probably operates the largest unauthorized medical and wheelchair ref, uh, repair referral program west of the Mississippi. I'm honored to call Mary Lou my friend and my colleague and to have had the privilege to work with her.